look, there's when we actually met. And then there's like the months preceding that where I felt like I knew you because no one could speak to me without saying your name. Is that true? Yeah. So you, and we'll get, I want to get into, you know, you growing up and and Cassidy Freeman as a young girl and what was going on and how and all that happened, because that's kind of like, I want to, I want to hear the story. I want to know like what you were like and all this stuff, but you, and we'll, we can get into the small stuff now, but like we met because your old agent, I don't think she's your agent anymore. Schmidt. Schmidt. She's still your agent. She's not your agent, but she called me and said, Hey, you know, my, my, uh, client, um, Cassidy Freeman is taking over for your role. She didn't say it like that. She just said, you know, that she's a new character on Smallville and you've left and, you know, she'd like to, you know, I'd, I'd love if you just have a chat with her. So I remember that. And I remember we had a chat. Do you remember what the chat consisted of? I don't. I do. I know. I want you to know. Bless you, Ryan. I was really stoned a lot that time in my life. So. You were really stoned? What? Were you a pot smoker? You don't appear to be a pot smoker. How? What does a pot smoker appear to be like? You know, someone who appears to be stoned. (laughs) You never, like, you came across, you just always seemed like very professional, very with it. Not that that you're not. Not that pot smokers can't be with it. I'm just saying... I didn't no, 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 think but of tell you. Tell me what the conversation was about. Let's let's leave my drug use to another. I, I think well, we'll get into your drug use and your your yeah, real. We will. Sincere. Uh, I you know I think it was just like what can I expect? You know I'm going up to Vancouver to shoot this and and I said listen it's the the hardest job in the world is stepping in as a guest star. Mm. That's the hardest thing you can do is go on to a television series that's already established. And say, hey, here I am. I'm Cassidy Freeman, and I'm taking over for Michael Rosenbaum, sort of. And I'm playing his sister, no, that, that's Tess. That's how it was always, yeah. That's how it was always described. And I just said, hey, the crew's great, and the cast is great, and they're going to be really warm to you. And mm-hmm. But I was lying. because uh, No, I wasn't. I was lying. But what was your experience? Like, you know, do you remember, like, were you nervous? You had to have been nervous. Absolutely. I was nervous. I'd literally done one guest star and one pilot before booking that in my life. That's it. That's it. So I had no idea. And the, and the pilot that I had done before becoming Tess Mercer was, um, another pilot for the CW that I did with Justin Hartley. So I weirdly had a touchstone coming with me. The fact that he was coming on as a series reg with me, um, and it was terrifying. Also, weirdly, moving to Canada was difficult. Uh, like in a, in the in the world of cell phones and rent, and I was still so young. Like I didn't know how, how to old get were an you? apartment. How old were you? It was 20, 24. 24. I think I started Smallville when I was twenty six or twenty seven. That's crazy. Yeah. I mean, you are a kid still. You're a kid, and now you're yeah. thrusted up into Canada. Vancouver, where it rains ninety yeah. percent of the time, and yep. you're playing this character in a season established yep. show and starting season eight. Yeah, yeah, everyone was really nice to me, you know. The, but it did feel very lonely sometimes because, um, you know, Tom's awesome, but he's a pretty private person. 